Okay, I see. I'm gonna show you how to see your gutsy character's eyes. Uh, who's going to face and add eyes? Well, I don't have any outlines to it, and don't have any pupils. The scolera, the scolera, the scolera, the scolera, or the scolera can be any colour, as long as it's not like. If, as long as it doesn't make it hard to, to shade, I might make this color a red actually. Okay, now you want to hide every other part of the body. No, actually, you don't need to hide every other part. You just need to take a screenshot of your OC. Go on, Gotcha Life. Don't go back on Gotcha Life, too. Go on to Ibis Paint, because that's what I use. Then add the image of your OC. And are you ready? Make it as big as you want. Okay, here we go. Now go in your selection layer. And just select it over here. Because we don't want this bit. We don't want this bit on, uh, on the OC. If you want to keep this bit, I guess you can... I guess you can do it, but this bit, but if, but if you don't keep this bit, it actually just makes it easier to shade. So yeah, I just recommend that you remove this bit. I like to use the selection layer to keep it all smooth, so yeah, you can use the selection layer. I guess this be useful for like... And the mating. Do, 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 do. And then you just need to book it. By the way, if you wanna know what pen I use, I use the um Okay, don't go don't go crazy. I use the hard Japanese pen smooth. That, 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 that's the pen I use if you wanted to. Just so just so you know which pen I I, I use so you know. You know if you just want to use the same pen if you know want to normalize that right now what I'm gonna do is I don't want the free brushes I don't want any free brushes I just want to get these bits filled in the very exact exact color of the eye guys it's it needs to be the very exact color as the eyes okay as the sclera so if it's not then 
you probably you're probably gonna mess it up. Now I'll just remove this selection bit and remove any of these little bits that you have if you have them. It's because they can be a problem. Don't remove the bits that you want, okay guys? Remove the bits that we don't that we don't want. Okay, so when you're finished um, covering up the bits that we don't want, then you get this airbrush, any airbrush trappers, any trapezoid airbrushes will be good. Make sure it's a black one though, and I've got to tell you this hard bit. You need to select the eye, not the sclera, not the sclera, okay? Not the white bits. Not the bits, not the, just let the bit that I'm selecting. The blue bit, the bit with the blue wire lines, that, that, yeah, that bit. The eye, because that's where you do your shading. That, that's literally where you shade. Select it all. Next, you get a trapezoid airbrush. I think that's how you pronounce it. Make sure it's black airbrush and, and just um, do that. And then you're going to do this. Make sure you have a small airbrush for this one. Um, just add random colours off the rainbow onto your OC's eyes. One by one. Like I'm doing it if you want to make it less confusing and hard. Just add random colours from the rainbow and just make them lines, okay? Don't make them any other shape but lines. It doesn't matter how far you get on each eye. You just need to add the exact same colour. Right, now you got a bigger airbrush. And you use the eyedropper to copy the colour of the eye. <coughs> And then you do that, you um, put the colour of the eye over the rainbow bits because you don't want people to see the rainbow bits. Basically, you just want to make them a little bit visible. Not too visible though. And not too un invisible. And then you add a lighter of the colour of the colour. Then you add a light version of that colour and I like to put that around 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 this bit. Okay, around and I like to put that around I like put that just arching under the black bit. And then if you want you can do this this bit's optional, but if you want, you can add your pupils like, like this. Then finally, adding your highlights. It should be an airbrush under 10px. And just add the highlights there. Just add the highlights anywhere. I just add them near the pupils, really, but you can add them anywhere. And then you take away the selection and then you'll have it. And then just zoom out. And there you have it. Perfectly shaded eyes. Give credits if you use this tutorial, by the way. Guys, when I say when you use this tutorial, I don't mean when you use this on your character's eyes. I mean when um, you make a tutorial and you use this exact same thing.